Satan. We are In that particular live, Karina kept stating that she got jumped. And then roll it, where, uh, roll it up KD. Now right here is, you see it right here. Now they both jumped right here. Right here, K is in it. That's K right there. Look at K. K got her. Now, still on her. So, but after K got up off of her, I'm trying to figure out what the fuck going on with Karina. You just sitting there letting that girl beat your ass like that. What in the fuck? You tell me, what? Recorded afterwards, you must have been tired. Because she whooped your ass. And K ain't even touching you. K just, yeah, she walking around recording. But the damn sister turned your ass up. Shoes knocked the fuck off. Both, both, both of them. Now Crystal want to get in it. Jazz X. They were wondering why she didn't show up. Because she's supposed to be, you know, uh, Karina's um, ride or die. And, you know, she didn't show up. And she was saying that because her mom came to get her bitch, she was supposed to be going home to clear her mind. And, uh, but, I don't know. I think Crystal got a lot of damn mouth. I don't think she about that damn life. She act like she is. I mean, I don't, anybody get into anything, you know, you're going to hold your own. But then she said, Crystal said this to uh, Kay, same motherfucker that was just calling to check on her and, Check on her and side with her. You weird clout chasing ass bitch. You still a girl. I'm going to show you how to stunt. So that's what she telling uh, Kay is, you know what I'm saying? We can do this. That's what Crystal said. You know what I'm saying? She said, I get active for show. Sure. Little do you know, I fight and slap my weed back on like nothing never happened. I said, I think she a lot of talk. That's what I think. I don't think she about that life because, you know, I'm pretty girls. And she's, you know what I'm saying? I just don't think she got them hands like that. Because, shit, I thought Karina could do something. And damn that damn, but uh, damn that won't, uh, she got her ass to up. I mean, even if we didn't see it from the beginning, okay, okay, they did jump you. I, they did, I saw that in the clip. They did jump you. But then, Kay, left it alone, and you let the assistant throw you down, jump on you, and continue to whip your ass, and you didn't do nothing. Oh, that's the assistant's, um, that's the assistant's shoes. That won't her shoes. But girl, I wouldn't be up here talking shit if you got your ass to up like that. I just would have left that alone. I would have left it completely alone and said to hell with it. Now, you sit here and fighting these damn men and shit, but you can't beat a bitch ass. Now, I ain't, I ain't condoning uh, that she got, you know, beat up by a dude or nothing like that, but damn, you jumping on niggas and shit trying to fight them because the word is you fighting your ex before flow. Uh, you and your ex, you used to get into it with your ex. So I'm trying to figure out what the fuck, who the problem really is. And I don't condone domestic violence. But my thing is when you know you're getting your ass to up and you still go back and you don't leave, then I can't, you know what I'm saying, to me, I can't sit here and say, well, that still don't mean he got to put her hands on her. You're right. But at the same time, that's what she want. You keep going the fuck back, look at Kay. Now, you know you wrong for jumping that girl. If you were going to fuck with her, you should have did it by yourself. Your assistant didn't have shit to do with it. And Kay said, none of them videos is the beginning. I'm going to let y'all paint whatever picture. And if y'all don't fuck with me, that's y'all business. I could care less because I built me. See, that's what I'm saying. See, that's how them damn motherfuckers get. They, they Them supporters run behind and... And uh, subscribe to and shit. They got that no, I don't give a fuck attitude. See, that's what I'm saying. Pretty bitches get their ass whooped. That's what happened to them. But see, that's what I'm trying to tell you. 
Exactly what I'm trying to tell you. That shit don't make no damn sense. Because if you getting your ass whooped and you keep running the fuck back, then you need it. That's the way I look at it. Because when you once out of the damn fire and you still keep going back to get burnt, then guess what the fuck you going to do? You going to get the fuck burnt. That's all it is to it. At the end of the day, it's just a rubber band situation. They is, um, it just, like I said, it's just a whole total chaos. Kay done got involved. Uh, Karina, like I said, she should, when she, when he put his hands on her the first time, she should have went on there. But when you got a woman that's used to the abuse, like I said, they said her first boyfriend used to put the paws on her too. So when you used to that type of shit and that's the type of way you want to live, that's the way you, you know what I'm saying? That's the way it, I don't give a fuck what, her next relationship going to be the same way. Niggas putting their hands on because she putting her hands on them. And they ain't saying, I'm just saying, stop doing dumb shit. Stop getting in these relationships and thinking it's okay to put your damn hands on a man. Shit, every man ain't built the damn same. Especially when you realize that motherfucker hit you back. It's time for you to get your shit and go and realize, okay, this ain't the one. But you stayed. Make me think you were trying to set him up. Then you go and talk pop shit with Kay. And then she sit here and um, jump you. Her and her assistant. The fuck kind of shit you was on? Did you not know that her assistant was going to jump you? Jump in that shit? Come on, Karina. You on drugs or what, baby? Damn. Make it make sense. I'm out. Y'all comment below and let me know what y'all know.